In this session, we are going to discuss about custom list in Excel. Custom list is a great time saver and at the same time, it cut down the chances for manual errors. In an Excel worksheet, when we type in Monday and drag it downwards using fill handle, the cells will be automatically filled with the rest of the series, that is days of a week. Same is with months of an year. I am typing in January here and will use the fill handle to populate the adjacent cells on right side. This is possible because Excel have the predefined list of days and months. Users also can define lists of their own. To view a predefined list or to create a custom list, go to options, click on advanced. Under the section called general, you can see the option to create or edit custom list. Click on edit custom list. What you see here are the predefined lists in Excel. To add a new list, type in the contents of the list here in this box. First element of our list will be serial number. Then press enter. Then item. Amount then remarks and we have four items in our list click ok now back to our worksheet i will type in serial number here and when i drag this to cells on the right side we have serial number item amount and remarks and now to the downward cells Now about creating a list from data in our worksheet. I will select another sheet which contains the list of some structures. Once again options, advanced, under the section called general, edit custom list. You can see here import list from cells. Click here. And now we can select the data. I will select these cells from I5 to I10. Click on import. And now we have a new list of structures. Back to our worksheet. And when I type box colored and drag it downwards, we have the new list here. And this list will be available to every workbook in my PC. Type in box culvert. We'll drag it to the right side. We have the new list here. Custom list can also be used to sort data. For example, if I want to see all these structures listed here in the order of my list, select the range of cells containing data, go to data tab in Excel ribbon, click on sort, select column C. Here we have to specify the order, click on the drop down list, select custom list, select our list of structures, click OK. Now the structures are sorted in the order of items in our list. Now some cool features of list in Excel. Earlier we populated the list to adjacent cells on right side and to the downward cells. Now into the cells above the active cell that is in upward direction. Now December in a cell, then November in next. Drag it downwards. The list will appear in reverse order. 
now january in a cell march in second one and drag it down we have the list of alternate months If the first item of the list is in small letter, the remaining elements of the list will appear in small letter. Same is the case when we use capital letters. If I enter an item from a predefined list into a cell, make a selection with the adjacent cell and drag it downwards using fill handle, the list follows the pattern. Now with two cells in horizontal direction, again with three cells in vertical direction. All those workbooks and code shown in my videos are available for download and you can find it in my blog. For feedback and discussion, please make use of the comment section. And if you are visiting this channel for the first time, subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon so that you won't miss any video releases. So thanks for watching. Have a great day.